Um, so in recent news in the past two weeks, we have seen Xbox and Microsoft go ahead and say they are, they put, build out a plan to put ads into video games. Um, and people are what we call pissed, uh, to say the least, uh, for quite a while, uh, cause it was rumored for Xbox more so than Sony. Um, the Xbox was going to do the ad things for about a month. And just last week, IGN tweeted and put on Instagram that Sony was like, no, nah, we're part, about, part of that train, too. Um, so I want to know how everyone feels about this, because Ham, though he is um, an Apex player, this man is also a 2K player. Mm -hmm. And there's already ads in that. And um, they're pretty funny, vicious there as well. Yeah. Funny enough, there's a few ads in MLB The Show as well. So... And it's just like, I don't, <clears throat> I mean, it just depends on the game. Like it fits for these sport games. Like they have 2K TV, they have, you know, running ads popping up for the store. Obviously it's all in right. game stuff, but like, that's, that's just what it is. Madden and will be the show. Like that's what it can do. I don't want to be playing God of War and then just be like, oh, stride five gum. You know, is it, you know, like, I don't want to be sitting there doing that while I'm playing those kind of games. So, you know, it depends on the games. I mean. Like I said, in sports, in 2K, I'm used to it. You know what I mean? I'm used to when I'm loading up for my, you know, my career game. Well, not this one. I don't think they do it on PS5 anymore because the load times this, are so quick. This 2K doesn't really have ads other than, like, when you log in and it's the, the, um... The, like, banner. 2K TV. Yeah, yeah, and then they have the banner. But before, I know for sure, and in, in, um, on PS4 for, for last year's 2K, like... When you would load up into your my career game, 2K TV would be right there. Like Ronnie 2K would be right there. They'd bring in, you know, sports players like Candace Parker. They'll bring Jason Tame. They'll talk, have a little interview. They do like dunk of the week or whatever, play of the week from around the world, which is dope. You know what I mean? And that's considered like that. So like that, I don't feel like that'd be a problem because it's already there in those games. And that's know? funny enough because in like when MLB the show, when I'm doing like my career. Well, I'm sorry, not my career. Road to the show. I have interviews. Uh, last night, uh, King Griffey was actually on the... What? Yeah, King Griffey was actually getting an interview right there. So it was just... It was awesome to see and how they implanted some of those ads is really good because they tailor to that type of particular mm -hmm. area. So, like, for ads, it's baseball-related. And for basketball, it's basketball-related. So it's not something that bothers me as much, especially with the seat, uh, the way for me personally, how the season's going. Um, I mean, in, in, in the MLB and in, in NBA, everything is popping like heavy. So it's good to see like people who are in that area, like the pros and, and good analysts, the legends and stuff like that. Even absolutely. So it, it's really good um, to hear all that. So, and in the positive of it, it's not too much. It's not overbearing, especially in our games. But we don't know how Microsoft and Sony is going to, you know, hit those types of things. So for me, I believe some of the ads in Sony, I wouldn't say ads, but just like promotion for like deals and stuff is already out there. I would want to know how they're going to do their ads. Hopefully it's not as bad as YouTube because I hate YouTube ads. I absolutely despise YouTube ads. I'm not buying. I'm not buying no premium just to Bro. skip past them. But. <laughs> You be into the little video you watch it, bro. All of a sudden, three ads, bro. I'd be like, bro, 45 seconds. <laughs> bro, absolutely god awful, bro. I just could not deal with it. It is it is terrible. But well, so like would it be in game or would it just be like, hey, I'm booting up my my PS5, boom, we gotta add, you know what I mean? Like, or does it have to be in game or would it be when I'm strolling through the store where they throw an ad up in there? You know what I mean? Like, I don't wanna deal with that. I don't wanna deal with just moving around on my PlayStation and being like, Oh, hey, here's an ad, let me wait to you know go or, check my or I'm, or I'm grooving or something. So like in YouTube, bro, like say I'm you know, I'm cleaning, I just I wanna watch live videos instead of just listening to Spotify. 
I hate when YouTube out of nowhere, when it's getting to the good part and they play some random ad, I'm sitting there like, bro, what the hell are you doing? Like, are you serious? Like, yes, I'm, 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 we're, we're about to hit the high <laughs> note of like, right. um, some, so Adina Howard, uh, t-shirt and your pa- panties on, you feel me? And she's getting into it. She's feeling the music. And then, then you hear, and hold on, hold on. Let me do my Cat Williams. Have you heard this quiet ass commercial of, did you take one of our pills that caused your left pinky toe to come <laughs> off and then your <laughs> arm just to turn purple? Please call us at 1-800-R-BAD. <laughs> Again, that's 1-800. Then you don't, you're not nowhere near the remote to press the skip button. So you're sitting there for a minute and some change to hear it. But then you got these ads that are 45 minutes long. I'm like, who the uh, hell decided to actually word. sit here and say this was okay? That's not okay. But then, let me say this: there be some ads on YouTube of guy of these local rappers or up and coming rappers I that know. pay for promotion. Mm-hmm. It be sometimes really good, and then sometimes not even bro, not even rough. It's some of the best comedy I've ever seen in my life. I can't even. In, uh, oh, BET so uncut. Stand up. Oh my god! Anywho, it's better than some of the random videos in BET uncut. Like, why did this make it? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But what are some of your guys' opinion on ads being on the platforms, and is it good or bad? And how do you think the ads will be done? So, let me clarify something because with this story. It is something that we should worry about, but at the same time, this is something that is uh, right now Microsoft and Sony are only exploring this in the realm of free to play games. So, like, your 2K does that because 2K has deals with NBA, and of course, 2K wants to make all the money in the world, so of course, they're going to do scummy things like make you pay to make your my player dunk make that game completely trash what you buy it every year i i do not understand like i don't know it's it's just a sidebar i will never understand why they're like hey you want to be an nba star you're going to be a a six seven power forward that's great cool you can be that but you can't dunk unless you give us another ten dollars to get more points to make your player better i'm six seven i should be able to dunk in my sleep what are you talking about but anyway um, so yeah, this is something that's only right now being explored for free games. And from what I understand, the way that they're going about this is to find ways to incorporate it into the game world. Um, so, you know, for instance, like if GTA Online was to go like fully free to play, you would probably see like, you know, and, I, and I'm going to channel some, uh, some Jet Moto energy here, but you'll probably just see like a random mountain dew billboard on a building or you know you might see a random i don't want to see a state farm billboard in apex yeah. okay i don't, I don't want to be running in apex and see this big old state farm with okay dude okay, okay. hear me out hear me out okay. hear me out he dying yeah. every day in that game but <laughs> at, at the same time it could be really good because I wouldn't mind seeing the Blue Chew ad in there because Blue Chew ads are hilarious. Yeah, but, but you got to understand with all these games, they're in their own world. So now you're like yeah. technically breaking the fourth wall because yeah, you're breaking the emerging. Yeah, and I agree with that. But I mean, what what makes things a little weird uh, is Genshin Impact is one of the main games that, that I hear brought up when, when they talk about advertisement. And it's like, this is like some weird high fantasy anime, like, area where you are completely in a different universe but it's like i'm supposed to just expect that coca-cola is there like that's strange to me don't do like, coke drink pepsi i'm what whatever you know what i mean but even i can't have even, a cool refreshing beverage in apex is that what you're saying right. i mean now is with it, apex you're getting shot at <laughs> no. oh, oh this is my thing with apex it would almost make sense because a lot of the maps already at least have these giant billboards in them already. Yeah, but those... And, and, and think about this. How often do you actually pay attention to those billboards? You're not really paying attention to them. Why? Because well, you're dodging bullets. Nah, some of them would be moving. That just shows, like, the kill leader. It depends on the map. But other than that, like... Like I said, like, it wouldn't make sense because this is its own world. Like, oh, this yeah, is no. on an island out in the future, actually. So, like... No 
Hey, but Pepsi's still trolling around in, tw- in 2079, right. bro. Oh, this, this, is, this is my argument there with something like that where they're already cycling billboards through. If they're like, boom, here's your kill leader. And then five seconds later, they cycle through and it's like a random, okay, we'll just go with Blue Chew. Random Blue Chew pops up and then they just flash back to whoever the leading team is. And then, then they go to, I don't know, Nike. And then they go back to Blue Chew or whatever. Like, in those instances, at least it kind of works, and they're not really going out of their way to do too much. But I don't, I don't want to see a big billboard. Like if I'm playing The Last of Us, and there's just like a, we'll, we'll say The Last of Us three, and there's just like this shiny, clean billboard. Like, hey, come buy Sprite, and I'm like, well, no, it's the end of the world. There is no Sprite machine. Go away. Exactly. Like, I, I mean, there, there, there are machines there. But they're just well, not they functioning. don't work, and they're and they're not producing shiny, delicious, crispy. So, 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 can I, can I have can right. I can I have AI uh, commercials and Horizon with giant only Robo Dinos? Only, only if by AI you mean Allen Iverson. The I'm question, not, bro. That's the only thing. <laughs> yeah, no, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm, oh, man. like what, like a random like Roomba vacuum commercial in the middle of. <laughs> Are you terrified of robots? Are you scared? Come get Matter you fact, a vacuum. Come get you a vacuum, or Boy, no we'll way. send Will Smith to smack the hell out of him in iRobot right. part Keep two. Keep my wife's <laughs> name. <laughs> right. Free oh, my man. Yeah. Free my man. Oh. But anywho, free, free. <laughs> free my man for real, bro. Free he count mans. bad right now. Man, free my man. He deserves. They just canceled Bright Two. Bright Two. They just canceled that on Netflix. They they canceled Bad Boys Five, and we're all over here. Like, I mean, he didn't even. Yeah, ask I'm kind of disappointed so okay. about that. I mean, hold on, hold on, I didn't ask for Bad Boys Four. No, I didn't ask for Bad Boys Four, but they gave it to us. I mean, I was oh, okay with three. It. Is the latest one, right? No, it's three, right? Yeah. No, yeah, three. Three's the latest one. Three. Three's yeah. the latest one. Bad yeah. Boys. Yeah. For life. Bad Boys. Bad Boys Two. Then Bad Boys for Life. And then yeah. was it Bad Boys Forever? Like what? I don't know. Like, and, and don't get me wrong; it's probably a, a fine movie, but no one, no one ever sat around and said, "Man, I need a third and a fourth Bad Boys." Yeah. They were just like, "Here, take it." And we they were, were even mean. reaching on this. I mean, it was cool. It was a good story. I was caught up in it. I loved it. But like, they were kind of reaching. Yeah, I, 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 that point for kind of sucks. It was, kinda, kinda it was sucks. not a fun I film. Nothing I, was I, going I, to top. Will Smith walking out of nowhere with a purple button up and Gabrielle Union looking as chocolatey as she could. There was nothing. There was hey, there is one thing though in in Bad Boys Three in the beginning. Uh, Martin Lawrence's daughter is getting married, and it's Reggie. That is the one thing I did like. Is they were like, "I'm glad you stuck around because you know they had a whole baby. They had a whole baby. They had a whole baby. He went to the military. Man had to toughen up, bro, because he was not ready for them. That's great. They so uh, marry Reggie. I love this. Yes, so so yes. random, random ads like that. I'm I am perfectly fine with. But moving along with the great gaming news. <laughs> 